um, we're gonna do a Taco Bell haul. Um, yeah, so I was massively craving they're just like chips and nachos, so you just get those little chips and nachos. <laughs> okay, chips and cheese, and then a the little bit of chips that we got there. And yes, um, it's actually 2 a.m. right now. <laughs> Oh boy. And I got two of these tacos because they're like my favorite. It's just like the regular hard taco, but it's like the the cheese one. So you guys have seen me like do a mukbang of this. That's bomb. I found some chips at the bottom of the bag, so score for me. Anyways, I don't know. I am eating Taco Bell in my bed. Hello. So it's been like 10 minutes. These chips are the grossest things I've ever tasted. I was looking forward to this more than anything else. They taste like poisoned, bitter oil chips. Disgusting. Okay, so Taco Bell, straw. I got a Diet Coke. No, it's actually a Diet Pepsi. They don't have Diet Coke, so. Oh. I prefer Diet Coke, so we're gonna try this. It doesn't give me the same effect as Diet Coke. Oh well, it is what it is. So, these are like one of my most favorite things from Taco Bell. It is their Doritos Locos Tacos. So for one of them is 170 calories which is not bad at all. So, I did get a few. So how are you guys doing today? That is so good. the simplicity but the flavor is like crazy literally it's just meat lettuce <laughs> and cheese what packs the punch is definitely the dorito shell so good Amazing. I don't know if you guys know, but um, I actually am a dietitian. <laughs> so weird. Like, I'm a dietitian nutritionist. I honestly didn't think it would ever happen. It's fucking so weird. Like, my dreams have come true. I only have one client though, which is quite unfortunate. Um, his name is Nicholas. He's struggling. But, you know, I'm here to help. That's all it is. I'm just here to help if you need my help, you know? Pretty tasty. So good. 
so things might start getting weird. You'll see. <laughs> Y'all are about to be like, what? <laughs> so this is just what I do. Now I'm just gonna eat the inside. <laughs> and before anyone thinks, I'm trolling, I'm not, I promise. Mm-hmm. That's bomb. Okay. Sorry, I'm like really hungry. <laughs> what type of laugh was that? Look at my fingers. Look at all this I did not eat. Like all the meat. <laughs> so I drastically lowered the calories on this. <laughs> For real. She probably will. <laughs> Crystal. <laughs> so yeah, we um we're pretty much done with Christmas almost. We still have yet to put up the tree. Like no for an answer either. You're like, we're opening them now. <laughs> There's this dude on Instagram and he like signed and I'm like, that's cool. Uh -huh. Reese Witherspoon was on the glamour uh, October in the US. And then Kate was the UK one. You are eating extra slow. Yeah. Uh, okay. I like to savor. <laughs> it could break from. Mm. When it comes to reading, like. The Twilight? Yeah. It needs to be big in the Twilight. Mm -hmm. Did they just stop making them? She likes windows, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> She's like, I don't know if I can step here. <laughs> it's been a while since we've actually had that mean spaghetti. Mm -hmm. Because we've been, you know, believe it or not, I used to like, uh, no, because I used to imagine spinach as being Like, I think the reason of uh, true. <laughs> <laughs> the majority what and why. I wonder if like the flower 
Because you have flour, mine's corn, right? I wonder if flour makes you cooler. Well, I'm gonna eat this last one. Spot. I can do it. How you did it, y'all? I feel like I'm not gonna want to eat anything for like I know ever a while. <laughs> Do you guys ever get so full that you're like, I'm never gonna eat again? It's like food is so gross. Hey guys, hey, welcome. I know this looks absolutely crazy. This is the Taco Bell tacos at home at the taco bar, and I figured instead of making homemade tacos, I was just keep it easy. Uh, Becky is eating over here, but she doesn't want to eat on camera. So first things first, I have a pineapple slushy, if you guys don't know. Well, it's called, what are they called? What are they called? I don't know. I don't know, but either way, it's a pineapple slushy. Um, pineapple's my favorite fruit. Oh, girl. That's right. So, what this comes with is chips, nachos, tomatoes, refried beans, cheese. I asked for onion and I asked for jalapenos. Those things do not come with it, so if you want to ask for it, go for it. Two things of lettuce, it does come with the beef, it's over there, it comes with two beefs, and actually two bags of chips, and it comes with soft and hard tacos. Um, I don't know what this is. It's like two random, it's two random uh, Dorito cheesy kinds. I don't know where it came from because I don't even know if that's part of it. So you know what I just realized? Look. It comes with two of these, like you can use that one for tacos, and I'm going to make it kind of like a taco salad. So I think I'm going to try to make a taco salad with this. Thank you. 
watching me because you're like, I don't want to be fat like her. Becky, no comment. <laughs> oh, I was like so immersed in the thought of this chip dog in my mouth. It's good. Yeah, I don't like her chips. Today we got some chicken egg rolls. They are huge. Like, how are you doing? Okay. And then some white rice with soy sauce. That is all that is. And over here is a Asian... How do I explain this? It's like a Asian... It's a recipe online. Let me just say that. Um, this is like an Asian pasta salad, really. It's just... Um, ramen but you don't use the season packet you just use like the tiniest bit and then you add a uh, cucumber and peppers and Italian dressing and it's so good so let me get this straight girl ramen carbs rice carbs for egg rolls carbs three carbs on a plate for egg rolls Alarming. Um, I didn't want to film many mukbangs in my room, which is where I'm located, but it's kind of easier when there's like people downstairs and stuff, and I'm like, um, I don't really feel like filming in front of you, so. Mm-mm-mm. So good. I really want to show my food as I eat it. People have suggested that, so. I'm in love with this stuff right here. It's mainly, you can tell, just cucumber. Oh, there's also cabbage, like lettuce and onion. I forgot to say that. I love white rice. It's a thing. If you guys are curious, this is cold.
I'm getting kind of full if I'm being honest. She knows what she's doing. Whatever. Using my fork. <laughs> hey guys, so I figured I would film a good old cereal mukbang. This is the only bowl that's clean. It's huge. Anyway. There's just a little bit more. Oop. I don't really like that like dust part. I just do it because why not? There are people who enjoy these videos. I, for one, enjoy these videos. So. Let's go. It's raining so hard I can't even see like out that window. This cat loves human food. My other cat, Wasabi, is not like that. The fastest. Cats love milk. You know cats aren't supposed to have dairy. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, freaking so cool. Ooh. Normally, I'll drink the milk, but this was just too much. So, you know, I can't. Okay, so we got Starbucks, and um, I got a iced coffee with caramel, and I'm afraid I'm not gonna like it. My mom got this like peppermint moment. Well, there's no peppermint on there. She said, "Do you not go to Starbucks often?" She she told the guy, "Where's the peppermint?" It's literally in it. Oh my god. So we're gonna do a taste test, or I am at least. Oh, <gasps> wait, it's actually good. I was scared. My mom was thinking I wasn't gonna like it. It has caramel, and I was like, extra caramel, please, and thank you. Yeah, I needed some coffee to pet my step a little bit. Are you gonna do a taste test for us? <laughs> Wish you guys could see her face. She's so weird. <laughs> She's opening the straw. She's taking the wrapper off the straw. Oh, Lord. <laughs> I thought there'd be peppermint. She's trying it. <laughs> Do you not like it? It's icky. <laughs> she said it's icky. It's kind of icky. You want to try mine? Try that one. Okay. We're doing swapsies. It's kind of icky, Amber. It's a little dirty. <laughs> it's a little dirty. <laughs> Ew, yours just tastes like a bath of sugar. <laughs> All it tastes like. It tastes like a bath of sugar. You can't even tell it's coffee or anything. It's just like this big old thing of sugar water. <laughs> sugar water? That's probably why I like it. <laughs> Alright, so we have two bags. I don't even remember what I got. Ooh, cake pop. Okay, sorry. I was like really craving that. We have a lemon loaf for my girlfriend. Oh, I also got a vanilla scone for me. So bomb. Oh, and I got a little salami and cheese thing. All of this is very low calorie, just same. She got some ice caramel. Caramel brulee? Kick. What? Who freaking knows? I don't even know. I just got a simple lemonade. Can you guys believe that this is only like 80 calories? Uh, yum. Oh, oh dang. Oh yeah. I added a pump of vanilla. Wait, I just like, I think I just changed the game on lemonade. Watch your hands go. Ready? I tried to 
wanted to fix hers up, and she still was like, no, I'm just going to give it back. <laughs> you don't like it? I just you guys have them. never had, like, for real coffee, have you? I must have had, like, you have to kind of stir it, because I feel like I ate a freaking sugar pebble. Oh, that's because it's cold. It's not really going to stir that well. Predicament. I got a white chocolate coffee thing and they gave me the wrong thing so I tried to switch with destiny even though mine's healthier even though it's bigger it's healthier and she went and added a bunch of sugar to it now it tastes better <laughs> yeah she likes it now I know how to make coffee I told good. you even though I shouldn't I be drinking done sugar so welcome to a new video so I'm just sitting here with some starbs um I didn't want to get the name wrong this is another one of my favorites probably neck and neck with the pink one. This is very berry hibiscus refresher from Starbucks. Mm. So good. I feel like I should have got venti. This is grande. This is only 70 calories. That's it. 70 calories. And then for breakfast, I decided to actually eat, you know, right when I woke up. I woke up probably hour, hour and a half ago, but I usually wait longer than that. So this is a, okay, I don't wanna get it wrong, so I'm gonna look it up, hold on. This is a spinach, feta, and cage-free egg white wrap. This is 290 calories. So it's literally just spinach, feta, and egg whites. So I'm gonna do a little taste test, because I don't remember ever trying this before, so. Oh my god. Wow. This is so good. I feel like I would not be able to make this this good because every time I make egg whites, it just never comes out good. So 290 calories, 70 calories, 360 calories for deliciousness. Not mad about it. Not at all. Mmm, so good. Wow. This is weird. I never think of Starbucks having like food items, you know? Damn. I think the feta is what also makes it really good. I'm a big fan of feta. <laughs> so good. So. Mm. Every time I'm watching a YouTuber <laughs> and they're doing like a mukbang or they just tried, you know, some food or something. They're eating on camera. They make the same noise as I do. Mm. It's like the most common thing. They go, mm. <laughs> Do you guys have like lemonades? Yeah, we have regular lemonade. Okay, awesome. What flavor of tea lemonade do you have? Same as her. Oh, <laughs> Doesn't even know your own name. Wow. I hope this is good. Let's try it. 
I forget. That white it's like a tea. tea. Yeah, I was eyeballing that. I was thinking about getting it myself. Oh, wow. What's the P-E-W? Peach white citrus tea. Let me taste it. I don't want to mm, it. so good. <laughs> you like it? Yeah, it's good. I mean, it's not what I thought it was. When you're hot and like exhausted, this is great. Oh, because I'm not hot and exhausted? <laughs> <laughs> so who won golfing? Me. Uh, we didn't keep track, so I was like, whoever gets the last hole first, we'll just win. Yeah. Yeah. What? What? What is that? Wait, what is this? Oh, this was where we were supposed Shit. to keep score and we didn't. <laughs> Oh wow! I'm too like, like I, I've never seen a place that actually looks prettier in person than the photos. Usually, it's the other way around. Like, look at that photo. This is an actual photo of the place. Oh, you jumped. Yeah, we're in trouble. We're in trouble. And I usually get a chai tea from Starbucks, but for some reason, no Starbucks around here has the chai tea. So I got coffee for the first time in. A hot minute, coffee gives me anxiety, so that's fun. It's just like a blonde coffee, like a vanilla, I don't know, who knows. And then I also got, this is a bacon sausage wrap. Um, looks like this, and I did ask for like four things of sriracha, did give them. Their sriracha is so good. I don't know what it is. I feel like I'm dreaming today. Like, truly, I'm so tired. I don't, I don't know, but that's okay. Oh yeah, that's good. So this just has like egg, sausage, a little bit of potato, something like that. I don't know. It's pretty tasty. Right now, I'm just sitting in Kroger's. I don't know about you guys, but I love to people watch. I don't know, that's really weird, I understand. But my mom does the same thing. Like, this is what it looks like. There's like a little food station over here, but I don't really know if I'm gonna get anything. And then the window. I'm actually gonna be hanging out with Hannah and Rafe today. I think I mentioned that already. So I'm just waiting for them. I ended up getting the white chocolate mocha. I don't really like coffee, but I really like this one. And for some reason, the straw is too short. See, I have to keep digging it out. So right now I'm at Target inside of the Starbucks. I'm filming in front of people. I feel very awkward, so I'm looking, I'm like trying to make it seem like I'm talking to my girlfriend, but I don't think it's working. Anyways, I went Black Friday shopping. Our limit was $107, and I will do a haul tomorrow because it is 2 a.m. Yep. At Starbucks at 2 a.m. Yes, I said 2 a.m. on Black Friday, and this is a pumpkin spice latte. At first I got one with coffee, and I asked the lady, is there a way you can make it without, and I was going to pay for it, but she was nice enough and did it for free. And my girlfriend has a um, chocolatey, something chocolate chip, that's all we need to know. <laughs> and... Uh, yeah, it's so good. So tasty, so tasty. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, you guys! So I'm trying this new. Um, it's what was it called? Something summer refresher and lemonade. All right, we're gonna do a taste test. No way. Well, those literally popped in your mouth. Like, and they have like a bunch of juice in it. Mmm. 
One to ten. And it's sour. Oh. This drink is sour. It's sweet, but it's sour. So if you don't like sour stuff, I don't recommend. Out of ten. Mm-hmm. Oh, I think the reason why I'm really scared is because of my weight, which is also my fault. <laughs> so, it's just, I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> I'm so upset and I'm so mad at myself. <sighs> I didn't even get a drink. I'll be right back. I promise the next time I make these videos, it'll be more like <laughs> ready. Like if I make more Diet Pepsi. <sighs> Isn't that weird? How even just getting up to walk all the way to the fridge, I get out of breath. I shouldn't be eating food like this then. Oh boy. I love them. And just to warn you, I eat like three at once. A lot of you are gonna hate this video. I feel it. Hate it. Okay, this is intense. What? Okay, it's a never ending bag. I love hot Cheetos. The last video I uploaded was the spaghetti mukbang. That just went up today, a few hours ago, so. Um, first comment I see is from Madison Mukbang, and she says, stop it, get some help. I'm happy that's actually the first, um, the first comment I see because. Mm. I have a dietitian, y'all. I have a dietitian, y'all. <laughs> I would eat this. Yeah. As I eat this. So, um, you guys have been telling me, get help, get a dietitian. Why don't you have a dietitian? You have a therapist, why don't you have a dietitian? You've been to the doctor, why don't you have a dietitian? You have money, why don't you have a dietitian? You're fat, why don't you have a dietitian? I have one now. <laughs> Um, yeah, I have a dietitian now, and I want to talk about it more in a video, more of like plot points, what she's helping me with, and what she told me to do. So, I know a lot of people are going to be like, oh my god, that dietitian don't know what she's doing, because when I saw the doctor, like, everyone thought I was, like, going to a doctor in, like, a back alley. I don't even know. I don't even want to get into that. Uh, what, babe? It says kind of Kentucky. They don't think we're, you know, sophisticated or anything. Oh. So... Okay, next comment is from someone named Amber Lard. Um, hello. They said, I won't believe because she probably made it up. I have no idea what you're talking about. I don't even remember what I talked about in the video that I uploaded today. So, no idea. Um, this one's kind of long. Queen of the Nine Nine. And they said, why? I am a nurse and I have written this before. I've cared for so many people that ate their way into the ICU. They chose food over life. The... BS, BP, edema, respiratory infections, <laughs> SOB, wounds that won't heal due to DM2, and I can go on. These patients were in their early 40s and younger. 30 is around the corner, and I really hope that you take care of yourself. Best of luck to you, Amber. Thank you for being sweet. <laughs> Eric, your face. What? what are you doing? You just look weird. Oh yeah, that's part of y'all's Christmas gift. 
Um, next comment is from well, Tedinator Cruz. Who else here legitimately believes that Amberlynn will end up bed bound? Yeah. So, funny story is. <laughs> um, um, sorry, Eric's behind me and doing weird things. Um, behind you? I mean, behind you! No, wait, no, I'm not. <laughs> what was it that I said last night, babe? I was like, oh yeah, there's neuro in this drink when I meant to say melatonin. I just don't know how to talk. I knew that. It's the diabetes. That's what I, no, not this. Whatever. <laughs> Hi, um, my name's Amber Lynn and I wanted to start, um, a YouTube channel for weight loss. I see a lot of videos of other people doing it and it's so motivating and it's just something I'm really, really interested in doing. I'm probably just gonna, I don't know, eat the rest of them. How much is in there? That much. And then I'm gonna have some of these mint chocolate cookies. I'll show you guys what they look like. <laughs> I'll probably have three or four of these. Actually, I ended up having seven of these. That's crazy to say it out loud. As I was eating them, it didn't even feel like seven of them. So, <sighs> I can't tell you how long. You guys know I love orange chicken. I love the Cheesecake Factory. Like, orange chicken is, I think my soulmate. And I feel like I could marry orange chicken. I know that's scary to some people and I just, I think it's wrong that people can't marry food pretty much because I would marry orange chicken every day and I would eat it every day I would wake up every day and fall in love with it all over again and just kind of experience the love I have for it every day every minute I don't even know if I would sleep to be honest I just I love it so much I like the texture and the thing is though you guys it's not the orange chicken from everywhere it has to purely just be from the cheesecake factory I have tried other orange chicken before and I just don't like it it's it's just not that good so the orange chicken at the cheesecake factory is just it's amazing it is the right texture the right flavor there's some vegetables with it and has tons of rice and I really just I wanted to do an orange chicken mukbang because I want you guys to see the love I have so um Cheesecake Factory. So I'm super, super excited. You guys are gonna look at it and just be like, it looks amazing. And honestly, it's never looked better. Oh, I'm so excited. So just please don't freak out because you're jealous that you're not eating the orange chicken with me. But you can always eat it too. Just if you have Uber Eats or you can drive to the closest Cheesecake Factory, um, don't go to No Panda Express, don't go to your local Chinese buffet. No, don't do that. The orange chicken at the Cheesecake Factory is the way to go. So are you guys ready? We have orange chicken. I am so just, I'm kind of in amazement with how good it smells. You can tell that the orange zest is completely from the earth. So I'm just gonna dive right in. I do use my fingers. Mm. And like I said, you have to eat it really fast. Mm. You don't want no one stealing it from you. Mm. You know, People judge my orange chicken love, but I can't help myself. I'm in love. So, one thing you learn about me, I don't like fat. Okay, let's dive into this. Sorry, vegans. Why are you so good? Well, I'll eat the whole thing. Mm -hmm. Okay. Came with a biscuit, but I'm good. So far, so good. Wings are so good. I can get over it. Mm. Okay. Brady was sniffing on the chicken. Really well. It's not bad. 
And I think the reason why I'm really scared is because of my weight, which is also my fault. So, it's just, I don't know, I don't know. I'm so upset and I'm so mad at myself.